Something special happened at Bronx Community College this summer. It's really a community of people who are just trying to succeed. In one first floor classroom, a melting pot of people who use their cultural diversity to come together in a children's literature class. There was a whole bunch of other classes that were listed as well, and this was the one that caught my attention. A class that wound up changing the lives of many students, including 26-year-old Melissa Cabrera. Just feel like, wow, you know, there's certain things out there or things that I, that I even go through or that I've experienced that, you know, I never felt like, oh, they were significant, but they are. With guidance from Professor Catherine Arnaldi, the students in the class were encouraged to write a children's book that reflected their own culture and life in America. Many of my students are working all day long. They come to college at night. Many of them were teenage mothers. And as they wrote their stories, they realized how much of an impact their own experience could have on future generations. As a child, especially in America, you know, where there's so many different ethnicities and cultures, it's hard to find your own. So I wrote about a parrot. His name is Antonio. He lives in the Dominican Republic. He is forced to migrate to New York City. He meets Emma um, in Central Park. She's a pigeon. They become good friends and, you know, she shows them the beauty in New York City as well. A lesson in English, life, and self-worth. Well taught.